LAS Vegas APJJ Spun shot a 6 under 65 on Friday at Breezy TPC Summerlin to take the lead in the suspended second round of the Shriners Hospitals for Children Open. Spun rebounded from a bogey on the par 4 third with birdies on the par 4 fourth and par 3 fifth and closed with a birdie on the par 5 ninth to get to 11 under 131. I think we were just real deliberate on our numbers out there, Spun said. It's super swirly, windy. Out here you've got so many undulations around the greens and you've got tight hazards next to the pins and the greens, so it's crucial to get the right number, and we did that well today. That kind of set us up for having a bunch of looks out there. Kelly Craft was second at 8 under with three holes left when play was suspended for the day because of darkness. He had a hole I known on par 3 fifth, using a 6 iron on the 174-yard hole. Spawn is making his third start of the season after finishing 97th in the FedEx Cup standings. He missed the cut in the opener at Silverado and tied for 34th last week in Mississippi. I'm putting well, I'm hitting it well, I'm just trying to play simple golf, Spawn said. I know it's not going to be easy on the weekend, but just trying to keep things in perspective and stay within myself and give myself a shot on Sunday. Robert Garrigas was four strokes back at 7 under after a 65. I really did and swing it as good as I wanted to off the tee, Garriga said. I was hitting some squirrely shots, but the putter worked really well today, which can cure a lot of things. Aaron Baddeley and Patton Kazai reached shot 66 to get 6 under, and for strong leader we Kim was 5 under after a 72. It was windy today, Baddeley said. There were a couple holes there where it was like a 2 or 3 club wind, which is really unusual here in Vegas. But it's just nice because it really brings out the good ball hitters and also the people who can be patient in this type of weather. Charlie Hoffman was 3 under after a 71 in his hometown event. Bubba Watson was in position to make the cut on the number at 1 over in his first event of season, shooting 7,271. Defending champion Rod Pampling also was 1 over after a 73.